All right, in this problem, we're solving x squared minus 36 equals zero. This is sort of like the previous problem, just one additional step in that we have to move the 36 over the other side. And since we want to get uh, rid of a minus 36, we're going to add 36 to both sides. Okay, we're going to do, so we're subtracting 36 from x squared. We're going to add 36. We're doing the inverse of the subtraction. So we're going to get x squared equals a positive 36. So we're going to, we're going to get just x. So we're going to take the square root of x squared to get just x. And again, we're doing that to the left-hand side, so we have to do it to the right. So we get x equals plus or minus 6, because we can have a negative 6 times another negative 6 equal positive 36. So this represents two solutions, which are x equals negative 6 and x equals 6.